All right, welcome back. So, in the last one, uh, we met Rand's mom, Daisy, at Farm Town, and she set us on some errands, and when we returned, she was gone and missing. So now we are heading to Windia's castle to get the power of the Great Bird so that we can fly to the Grand Church and rescue Daisy. So now we're in Windia's basement here. So when you get to this statue, you actually have to um, move forward with Nina alone. So mine should be okay, but if you haven't been leveling yours up, you might want to do that a bit. Maybe on Monster Island or something. And also, these uh, boulders you see, they actually move, but only when you do. So you've kind of got to plan your movements a little bit. And on a side note, each of these statues will say something. I wasn't expecting you to say that. That was pretty mean. <laughs> and what are we going to fight in here? Oh, we're just going to fight more of, like, these things. Okay, um... Let's try and kill it with Missile. Oh, looks like she's going to cast some spells on Nina. Although that's better than her hitting with her, like... Egg beater attacks. Those are nasty. Sweet! Holy crap! 468. Was not expecting that much damage. Okay, so let's heal yourself up. And try and see what this statue says. What are we gonna fight now? Oh, another one! Okay, so let's obliterate you with missile. Oh! No! Okay, she kept her shaman. Even when it doesn't crit, it hits these things hard. So they must be weak to it or something. Mm, considering I'm having to use her magic, I'm probably just going to use the items to heal her up. You came here for the great wings? Don't be so cocky. You could never do it. Okay, so I'm guessing all these statues bash her. Like, bash on her. The Wind BR. Okay, so that's going to increase her agility. Or her vigor. Okay, so... Wisdom... Or spell crit chance. Let's see if this will make her fast enough to go before things. Because if it does, that'll make life easier in here for me. Oh, well, this is an unfortunate thing, because this is probably slower than the, uh, winged woman. Oh, it's not! Okay, which means I'm not faster than it. So then, yeah, I'm just going to take off that stupid agility thing. Well, it's not stupid, it is nice, but I'm going to take it off and put back on her wisdom thing. Or, you know what, I'm going to hold it just to see if it is, like, going to make her faster than, um the Barracuda Flying Girls. I have a lot of W for it, so I can afford to use her magic for heals and attacks. Oh, there's a treasure chest up there. That, that I want. Okay, are you going to be faster than I, uh, these things? Nope, but you did dodge the first hit. Ooh, and the second! Good job, Nina. But yeah, so I'm just going to take off that uh, agility boosting item and put back on the uh, wisdom one, just to make her a little bit stronger. Going to have to boost up or uh, replenish her ability point soon, because um, as amazing as the um, missile spell is, it costs 26 ability points to use, so it's expensive. I think I need to wait for this rock. Yeah. Oh, did she need to heal? Oh no, I just healed with her. So I just fought another one of those gargoyle things. The wind robe. Okay, is that gonna make her faster? 
Okay, it will. So that will make her faster. I kind of want to keep the wisdom, but considering she's going to gain 20 defense points, I'm going to do that. Put that on, because now I think she's going to be faster than things. The only reason I keep mentioning her speed is because I remember her usually being faster than the monsters in here. So it was throwing me off. Oh crap, this one comes this way. Okay, let's see her speed now. Nope. <laughs> Although she is taking a lot less damage now, so that's a plus. She was getting hit for like 50-ish before. Beautiful. Okay, so I'm not going to uh, heal her and then use the items on her to get her back her ability points because even though she's going to go down to one, um, she can still keep getting points. So it's better to just do that and then um, that because then she'll actually be completely full rather than doing the healing and then the um, ability point items. And what's this statue say since we're going to be here? You can never be human again. That is the same as dying. What the hell are you talking about? So I just remembered I need to um, put back on that wisdom item. Since her speed don't matter. Are you prepared to throw your life away to become a bird, Nina? I see. Goodbye then, Nina. What do you mean, throw her life away? Why do we gotta do this? Oh, this looks nice. We protect these strong powers. Why do you desire these powers, Nina? To save the world, dumbass! Or that. Yeah, see, exactly that. Like I said. We're gonna try. I mean, there's nine of us. Lovely. Okay, so... I can't really think of anything to do for this, except just hit it with missile, since it's our strongest spell, and hope we survive. Okay, we are faster than it, so as long as we don't get hit in one, like, killed in one shot, I can heal up. Oh. I didn't expect it to be a pro much of a problem, but I wasn't expecting that. The Mark of the Wing. Oh look, it's the Nina from Breath of Fire 1. Great, 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 great grandmother. Sounds great. It's my fault that the family no longer has the powers of the great bird. And why do you say that? I fell in love with a man from another tribe and weakened the powers of our tribe. Oh. And then they slowly lost their inheritance to fly and transform into birds. Oh man, are we gonna lose Nina now? Well, we got blue on the back burner. That's her, like, flying up and away to say goodbye. I don't think it matters what you say here, so I'm just going to say yes. Could have said no. Probably doesn't matter. Okay. So I can move around again, and I think I can exit out of here. I cannot. Lovely. I will see you guys in just a moment.
Okay, so once you make your way back to the statue in the center, you can just leave. In fact, you could do that at any time. Um, you're not stuck in here once you go in. I do think I have to, yes, change the group around again. Auto, scramble, and can I exit out of here? Oh, I cannot. Okay, so I'm just going to walk out of the basement and cut out all the fights, so I'll also cut out the walk. I'll be right back. Okay, so we're out of there now, and basically we have to take the uh, acquired wing or whatever to like this new area of the castle. I think it's upstairs actually. Well, it's not like a new area, it's just that we can now access it. Oh, it's supposed to be down here, so I guess we'll talk to the king and he'll let us do it. Or maybe the grandfather? Nope. Oh, do I have to talk to him with Nina? I do! I got the mark. Poor guy can't even open his eyes or see. One of the two. Not exactly save you, more so to save the world. <laughs> Which you're part of, so kinda, but not really for you. Aw, sweet. Even though he abandoned her, and for good reasons, they still love each other. Uh, excuse me? What are you doing? <gasps> Is she taking the thing? She took the thing. Oh, well, this sucks. Why isn't Nina fused anymore? Oh, well. So now we've got to go to where I thought we had to go, which is up over here. Hey, you. Get back here. Open this door, right this minute. What does that have to do with anything? So, I mean, you're a princess. You're not going to know these things for a while. Say what? Are you going to turn into the bird? Looks like she's going to do it. Well, that's pretty goddamn tragic. Her sister sacrificing herself to turn herself into a great bird for us. You can hear Nina trying to break the wall down. Mm. 
Well, damn, it looks nice. But it was her sister. Don't say anything right now, until everything is resolved. I won't shed any tears until then. Right now, we must defeat the demon that is trying to destroy our world. We must do it for Mina, who sacrificed her life to be our wings. So this music is actually the music you'll hear whenever you fly around on the bird. Because now you get to fly around on the bird! All this sad shit, and there's some good news for ya! So... Where do we go first? Actually, I know exactly where I'm going to go first. I need to go... It'll be easier if I go this way. I actually want to go and get the better fishing rod that I was talking about when I went and did all that fishing before. Um, this is it here. So, the bird is Nina's, like world special. The way that Rand can turn into the ball and like Jean turns into a frog. Nina now summons her sister in bird form so we can fly her around. But yeah, one of these chests of uh, ch like dressers, dressers or something should have the charm rod. There it is. The charm rod is I think the best rod that you can get or at least it's good enough for me to fish up um, treasure chests. Okay, so let's see here. Now, this is actually the church that you would go into to progress the game. And go looking for Daisy, this church right here. But I'm not going to do that right now. I'm not going to show off a whole bunch of stuff. I'm just going to show off a little bit of locations. I think it's over this way. Yes. So this place here. Oops. Um, if you didn't get, like, Beretta, the third tenant in your town, this place is going to have pretty much the best available items that you can buy. Uh, there are some better ones that you'd have to, like, get from items or monsters when they drop items. For the most part, this is going to be the best stuff that you can buy. Like, look at that damage increase right there. Uh, Amber Ring, don't need it. Wisdom Robe. Not bad, I mean, I think Nina was just using it. Which is apparently better than this thing. Uh, brave armor, better than hers. Life armor is going to be hard to beat out. The mother robe, which is actually a really good uh, p piece of, like, gear. Same with the sun mask and the holy shield. But yeah, like, as you can see, pretty much everything here is going to be a huge upgrade for you. And I do want to show off something else. Where is it? Oh, maybe not. Okay, well, one thing I will show you... Mm, where is it? I think it's here? Or here? But there's a fish that you can, like, a fishing spot that will show up somewhere along this area. Here. And uh, it's got a really nice secret treasure in there, which I'm going to actually go into in the next episode. Uh, instead of doing like a long episode about my fishing and my treasures and stuff, I'm going to just do clips at the beginning of my next one and kind of catch you up on what I did in between episodes because pretty much done for this one now. Um, probably going to go back to, uh, yeah, I need to go and fuse, but I'll do all that in the next episode or in between episodes. But thank you guys so much for watching this one with me. Uh, in the next one, we're going to have to go to that church and see where Daisy is and try to get her to come back with us. But again, thank you so much for watching this episode, and I hope you guys have a great day.